Hello students, welcome back to practice maths. Today in this video we are going to find the solutions of integration uh, exercise 6b section 2. So, there are section 2 uh, 41 questions are there section 2 41 questions are these questions we are going to find the solutions today in this video now starting with the first question here section 2 evaluate the following integrals here. So, here given question is first one here solution like this. So, integral 3 x minus 2 whole power of 1 by 2 dx is then uh, so, here we have to find the solution of this one. Here I will take 3 x minus 2 is equal to t. Okay, dt by dx is equal to I will do d by dx of uh, 3 x minus 2 will come here. It will become uh, 3 into 1 will come here dx dt by dx is equal to. So, dt is equal to 3 into dx 3 into dx. So, this uh, 3 will come this side and dt by 3 is equal to dx will come. So, where dx is equal to we have to put here. So, integral 3 x minus 2 is equal to t, t power of 1 by 2 into, uh, so he, this is dt by 3, no? so here dt by 3 will come. So, I will, uh, 1 by 3 I will uh, uh, keep outside the integral, so it will become 1 by 3 into t power of 1 by 2 dt will come. So, it will become 1 by 3 into, so t power of 1 by 3 is equal to the formula is integral x to the power of n dn dx is equal to x to the power of n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 will come. So, this is the formula where we have to use this here. Okay. So, if t power of 1 by 2 plus 1 by uh, 1 by 2 plus 1 will come here. So, it will become 1 by 3 into. So, t power of 1 by 3 means t power of 3 by 2 divided by 3 by 2. So, this 3 by 2 come upside it will become 2 by 9 will come here. Means t, t power of 3 by 2 is the answer here. t is equal to what? 2 by 9 into. So, t is equal to 3x minus 2 on a whole power of what is there 1 by sorry not 3 by 2 is the answer here. Now moving to the sixth, second question. Now second question is given that solution here. So second question is given integral 1 by 7x plus 3 dx is given. Na? So from this uh, 7x plus 3 is equal to I will take it as t. Okay. So dt by dx same process is equal to 7 will come here and uh, dx uh, sorry dt is equal to uh, dx into 7 7 into dx or dt by 7 is equal to dx so I will submit in this one integral 7x plus uh, 3 is equal to t I will take I took now so t into dx is equal to what I will write dt by t so it will become sorry dt by 7 1 by 7 into integral of 1 by t and dt will come here so it will become 1 by 7 into integral of 1 by t into dt is equal to log t okay log t will come here so this will t is equal to 1 by 7 into log t value t is equal to 7x plus 3 so log of 7x plus 3 will come here so this is answer here where we have to find now moving to the third question now third question is here given that solution third question what is integral log of uh, 1 plus x divided by 1 plus x is given into dx so, for, from here I will take log of 1 plus x uh, is equal to t I will take. So, dt is equal to 1 by x 1 by 1 plus x dx will come here. Okay. So, 1 by 1, by 1 plus x dx. So, here 1 by x is there. Na? So, this 1 by x into dx will come. So, log uh, uh, log of 1 plus x is equal to I will take as t, t no. So, t into dt will come here. So, t into dt. So, here t into dt means here what will come here? Huh? what will come t into dt is equal to so you know already formula x to the power of n is equal to dx is equal to x to the power of n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 na. so this here integral uh, integral will goes and it will become t power of uh, 1 plus 1 divided by 1 plus 1 will come here so it will become t square divided by 2 will come here so t square divided by 2 so t square is, t is equal to how much here log x no so log of 1 plus x log of uh, 1 plus x okay divided by 2 so this is whole square for this log of log of 1 plus x this one so this is answer here for third one now moving to the fourth one now fourth question is given that here the solution so given question is integral 3x square minus 4 into x dx is given question so from this I will take a 3x square minus 4 as a t here okay so dt is equal to it will become 3x square minus 6x will come and dx will come here. So uh, x dx is equal to dt by 6 will come from this. So I will submit here. So integral 
so is equal to integral in this place i will take t so dx uh, x dx is equal to x dx is equal to dt by uh, 6 will come so from this 1 by 6 into integral of t into dt same 1 by 6 into integral uh, sorry here uh, t square divided by 2 will come na? so this i already told you the integral x to the power of n is equal to dx is equal to x to the power of n plus 1 divided by uh, n plus 1 so same like this here only so it will came here 1 by 6 into t is equal to how much 3 x square minus 4 power of square divided by 2 will come so this is answer here now moving to the fifth question now fifth question is given that solution here so integral dx divided by under root of 1 plus 5x is given here so 1 plus 5x is equal to i will take it as like a t okay so under root of so this under root of total so here 1 plus 5x is equal to uh, t power of on i will square both sides it will become 2 will come so squaring on both sides okay so here dx by dt is equal to uh, will come as it will become 5 will come here 5 into dx is equal to uh, 2t dt will come here okay now from this dx is equal to what will come so 2 by 5 into t into dt will come here so i will take here it will become dx is equal to what we have got uh, so first i will write this one it will become under root of 5 is equal to 1 plus 5x is equal to t na? so 1 by t into dx is equal to i will write it as this total 2 by 5 into uh, t into sorry t into dt so here this one so 2 by 5 will come out here into 1 by t into t into dt so t t will get cancelled here what 2 by 5 integral of dt will come so here 2 by 5 into t will come here so t is equal to what the value here 2 by 5 into under root of 1 plus 5x will come here so this is answer here what we have to find now moving to the next question now sixth question is here given the solution here integral 1 minus 2x cube x square into dx will here given so from this i will take 1 minus 2x cube as a t so dt is equal to it will become uh, minus 6x square will come here so dx will come so here i will take uh, I uh, will bring this one this side and dt is equal to minus dt by 6 will come here into x square into dx will come. So this value I will uh, put here and this is become t. So integral t into so this total t na so to t into x square dx is equal to minus dt divided by 6 will come. So minus 1 divided by 6 integral t into dt. So what is the t value here? t square divided by 2 no. So minus 1 into uh, minus 1 minus 1 by 6 into sorry into so t value is equal to what t square by 2 t uh, t no 2 into so here minus 1 by 6 into so t is equal to how much we got um, how much we took 1 minus uh, 2x cube okay whole square will come here this is answer by 2 this is answer here okay moving to the next question seventh one now seventh question is given that here solution Seventh question is what given integral secant uh, square x divided by 1 plus tan x whole cube into dx. So here I will take 1 plus tan x uh, is equal to t. So dt is equal to it will become tan x is equal to secant square x okay into dx will come. So I will submit in this place okay. So dt is equal to so from this integral uh, 1 by so this is total 1 by t cube okay into uh, d t so what is the value of t uh, t cube is means so here we know that uh, integral x to the power of n dx is equal to uh, x to the power of n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 no so this formula will use here because uh, how it will be means uh, integral t power of minus 3 will come this so it will goes numerator will become dt so if integral we do though it will become t power of minus 3 plus 1 divided by minus 3 plus 1 so it will become t power of minus 2 divided by minus 2 will come so we can write it as uh, uh, 1 by uh, 2 minus 2 t square okay now so where two val uh, t value is here tan 1 plus tan x here so it will become answer is minus 1 divided by 2 into uh, 1 plus tan x whole square this is square here square so this is answer what we have to find here 
so here secant uh, square x divided by 1 plus tan x whole cube dx is equal to answer is this now moving to the eighth question now eighth question is given that solution here so it will become x cube into sin x power of 4 into dx na. so here i will take x power of 4 is equal to t okay so there dt is equal to 3 x power of uh, sorry 4 x power of 3 into dt will come here so sorry, sorry dx sorry dx okay so here 4 will come this side dt divided by 4 is equal to x cube and dt will come so dx will come so x cube dx is equal to what we can write it as uh, dt by 4 so here uh, integral sin t x power of 4 i will will took t na so this t into dt so dx dx cube dx is equal to what dt by 4 dt by 4 so 1 by 4 will come outside it will be integral of sin t uh, dt so what is the integral of sin t so sin this value will become minus cos t integral sin x uh, dx is equal to minus cos x okay so we use this one here so it will become uh, cos t minus okay so 1 minus 1 by 4 into cos t so t value is how much here t value is equal to x power of 4 so this is the answer here what we have to find integral x cube into sin power of 4, x power of 4 into dx now moving to the ninth one so here ninth question is given that solution so integral cos x divided by 1 plus sin x uh, dx whole square is there here square is there square i took here now here i will take 1 plus sin x is equal to t so here dt is equal to sin x will become uh, cos x will come okay cos x dx hey uh, dear students here think that uh, take here d by dx of sin x is equal to cos x okay but d by dx of sin x is equal to dx is equal to it will become minus cos x will come when integral will do to so it will become derivation no so that's why cos x only will come so cos x dx is equal to dt so here integral uh, sin x is equal to what we took 1 by t so 1 by t into so dt will come so 1 by t value is equal to what we can write it as log okay what we can write it as log t but here square is there na? so t square it will become so t square means what we can write it as uh, t power of uh, minus 2 plus 1 divided by minus 2 plus 1 it will become t power of uh, um, minus 1 it will become down it will become minus 1 by t will come here so minus 1 by t will come so 1 by t is equal t is equal to how much minus 1 by 1 plus sin x will come so this is answer here what we have to find here now moving to the next question now 10th question is given solution here so it is integral third root of sin x third root of sin x not okay uh, not 3 into third root of it will become cos x dx okay so i will take sin x is equal to t so d by dt is equal to sin x is equal to cos x dx okay so cos x dx is equal to dt and sin x is equal to t so here integral uh, under third root of t into dt will come here so it will become i will write it as t power of 1 by 3 i will write into dt so t power of 1 by 3 into dt so what is the x to the power of n integral dx is equal to x to the power of n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 so i am writing because every time so uh, you understand easily so you, whenever you uh, like uh, solving a question it will like compel, uh, easy to under, easy to like remember that's why i am doing i am writing here many times so it will become t power of 1 by 3 plus 1 divided by 1 by 3 plus 1 will come here so it will become t power of 1 by 3 means 4 by 3 so it will become 4 by 3 so t is equal to what uh, uh, 3 by 4 into t is equal to what what we can sin power of sin x whole power of 4 by 3 will come here so this is the answer what we have to find now moving to the next question 